morning world and all who inhabit it. Thumbs up. You excited? <laughs> I'm gonna do some abalunis. If we put too much salt, it'll be a little too salty. I wanna kiss you now. There's a hair on it. It's a vision hair. Just me and Zach hanging out. Oh, and then there's Ian. <laughs> He's all blacked out with his little put coffee. Baby in the Don't put baby in the corner. <laughs> that was the worst noise ever. <laughs> Morning world and all who inhabit it. SpongeBob. I'm not gonna lie, I didn't even train legs yesterday, but they hurt. I did um, jogging as my cardio yesterday, which I can do. I could pick whatever cardio I want for that 20 minutes. So I did jogging. I don't know why. Um, and my body's like aching from it because I'm not used to jogging. So we're gonna buy some Stairmaster. 20 minutes. <laughs> this is what I listen to. our 20 minutes we were able to move up from level 6 to level 7 since I'm trying to keep my heart rate around 135 between 135 and I think 150 or 145 eventually you kind of get used to like doing cardio at a specific speed like your body gets used to it and you don't burn as much calories so you have to go up and um, that's the annoying part like the more I guess cardio what's the word hold for a moment. I don't know what to talk about when I talk about cardio because I don't know cardio things. Your cardiovascular health is very good. That's what it is. Then you're able to do it a lot faster. But for me, it like takes very little right now to burn amount of calories. <coughs> now we do some sprint skis. Shins hurt. So we go, like you guys saw in the last video, for 30 seconds and then we wait about the minimum 90 seconds until we go again. Bad. 
on that last one, my foot literally went like, <laughs> and I had 10 seconds left. And I was like, you should stop. And I was like, no, you got 10 seconds left on my jank ankle. I don't know why it hurt more today than normal, but it was probably because I jogged yesterday, so my body's a little sore. But um, what's cool is to know that when I continue to do this, like we're at the beginning of prep and we're just starting to do sprints and we never do them, but imagine how easy it's gonna be at the end. Like, first of all, I'm gonna weigh less, so I'm gonna have less of a body to actually like sprint with. And then I'm gonna have higher tolerance for cardio. Hit on this really hot guy. Wait. I've had a crush on him for weeks. Hello! We're gonna do some abaroonies. Ab abaroonskis. <laughs> Ian and I, I'm pretty sure I already told you, but we have this inside joke where we just add skis to everything. So like when we text each other, we text it in like emojis. So if he sends me something funny, I sent him like the skull emoji and then the guy, the emoji of the guy like skiing and it means I'm dead skis. And then if he's like, okay, I'm on my way, I'll send him like the needle emoji and the skis and it means dope skis. <laughs> it's probably just, just funny to us, but it's really funny. Okay, we're gonna do some abs. You guys saw in the morning routine video that we, um, <coughs> that we do like four different ones and we just, I'm missing a nail also. I haven't got my nails done, I need to get my nails done. So we do four of them, um, about like 10, 10, 10, 10, back to back, um, three sets of those. So I'm gonna do some that are a little bit different than what I normally do just so I can mix it up a little bit. But first we're gonna start with the um, vacuums since I'm on an empty stomach and I wanna be I want my stomach to be fresh for y'all because if it's not, it, it's way harder to do it. Like if my abs are tired or if I have food in my stomach. Okay, I'm gonna pull up my shirt real quick. So, what you wanna see, <coughs> you might not be able to see it when you're not lean, like you have a little body fat, which is what I have right now, but you'll see like your ribs popping out right here and right here but you wanna blow it all out. And then you wanna suck in, pull it all the way, like your belly button needs to be pulled to your spine. But people always say that, but I think of like pulling it to your spine and up also, like you're going up into your rib cage. So let it out. Also, my waist looks snatched from this angle, but it's not. That's nice. Abs. <laughs> One. Two. <laughs> you guys said you wanted more vlogging. This is what you get. Uh. 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 This weirdly works. <laughs> Honestly, my skin was looking so bad, like leading up until prep, because obviously I was eating more of processed foods and stuff, but my skin has seriously cleared up just in these couple of weeks of doing prep, like really what you eat. Like I was breaking out all like around here, 
and here, and here, and now it's gone. It's like a coffee. Yeah, it's, it's just called an espresso. Oh, so it's pretty much like a theory. Yeah. Copy just that. fancier. Yeah, I need to fill these up though. Are you okay? Excuse you. Hello? He wants attention for the bad <laughs> thing he did. down in that because it's not it cold in here keeps this place on 65 <laughs> and it's freezing down here compared to upstairs and she's over here hot and sweating in 65 degree weather my huevo this is my breakfast ew <laughs> pre -re pre ready to go and ian gets to have hash browns eggs and beef. Beef. I get to make homemade breakfast tacos. Get out of here, would ya? <laughs> Kombucha. Kambuka. Kambuka. Guys. No, it's kombucha. Kambuki? But you could say it however you please because it's adorable. Potato, potato. Yeah, yeah, sure. Never met somebody that says potato. Why? Why do and no one says tomato? Well, people do say tomato. In like British land. Correct. No, it's not kombucha. That sounds like a disease that you would get from staying on an island too long or something. No, this is what we do with my huevo. This is my little huevo and I eat him every day. There's a hair on it. It's a vision hair. What the heck? Maybe because he gets all up in my grill. He does have hairs everywhere. Okay, so this is what you do with your huevo. You put a little bit of cayenne. Bah, bah. No. Get down. Get down. And then some everything but the bagel season. I'm not even gonna pretend I'm distinguished. I use my mouth to open most things. And it usually looks prettier than this, but it kind of broke, so. For me, this is the easiest thing to do for breakfast because I can make all of the eggs on like a Sunday for the week. And like I said in the last video, making one egg on a pan is just, seems ridiculous to me. And then I can make this. And I used to be a fan of like hot oats. Like you guys have seen my last preps where I was eating hot oats and I really loved it. And now I'm just like a fan of the cold oats.
meal number two. Mmm. Damn, that's really sweet. I got my meal plan here. It's literally right on the fridge, right here. Right next to my scale, so I can measure everything out. Um, I got this Walden Farms Raspberry Vinaigrette salad dressing because I have a couple of meals that are uh, lower carb, so I can do like a lot, a lot of veggies, and then with like a lean protein, which is like what I have right now, so I have olive oil on this, and then we have the protein from the shrimp, and then since it is a low carb meal, we have just a ton of vegetables. So to switch it up, so I'm not just having like veggies, I do like a salad, then I'll do veggies with a meal or something, but it's pretty good. The Walden Farms Raspberry Vinaigrette, zero calorie. Now we have to get two more meals in before we work out. Because my pre-workout meals, the way that my meal plan is structured, it's structured so that um, I have like mo the moderate carbs in the morning, which I have for breakfast, so I can replenish myself after cardio. Then we go into the lower carbs, and then we start like building the carbs up, up into my, um, my uh, workout, so that I have enough energy. So like you'll see on my meal plan, the calories go up the closer that I get to my workout and we have less fats around my workout and higher carbs. I'm also gonna take my first form digestive enzymes with it. I take a couple of these after almost every meal. You can take them uh, four, three to four times a day, two capsules three to four times a day. So that's what I'm doing is almost after every meal, I take them so that my digestion is good. And then my carb meals, I have GDA, which basically is a glucose disposal agent, which helps make sure that you are taking in the carbs and absorbing them to use for energy. Yeah, honestly. And I can hold the camera when you get back. Yeah, I'm just putting my hands in it. Just 100 grams. Wow, that was 98. You can't have any. How many times have we talked about this? 98. 99. That was a gram right there, what I just dropped. 100. Honestly, that was extra, but, I mean, I was being extra, but we got it up exactly 100. And then, rice. So, for my pre-workout meal, kind of like I was explaining before, we have leaner proteins little to no fats so for us for and this is not me giving you advice this is just how my coach has it which um is typically how even zach when he was coaching me he would do it but yeah having lower fats and focusing on higher carbs damn that's a nice hefty amount damn that went over really fast micro just be a I was like, usually there's six of them. Okay, my water. Excuse me. And my water is already, this water is already almost complete. So when I go to the gym, I wanna have it full. So I'll put two of these here grapes. I just like the flavors. And then ice and fill her up. Where are you going? <laughs> okay, she's ready to go for the gym. People think it's weird, but like I eat my food in the bathroom while I get ready and do my makeup. And I think it was like my last prep, but people were like, you eat your food in the bathroom? And I'm like, yeah, so what? It's not like I'm sitting on the toilet and eating it, you know what I mean? But people think it's weird, but it's like, I usually, it takes my makeup quite a bit, you know? It takes a hot minute to do, and I wanna have my meal an hour before I do my training so that I'm not 
it has time to digest and I'm not just sitting around with tons of food in my belly. So I'm gonna have some green salsa on it. And I know it might seem weird, but I'm gonna put everything but the bagel seasoning on it because I basically put it on everything. It don't matter because I'm literally the only one who eats this. Since this meal has higher carbs, we have to take the digestive enzymes with it too. We just take that basically with every meal. And then we're taking the mat, mat, gluco disposal agent, two of those, so that my body can cling to these carbs like there's no tomorrow. Get ready, Freddy, for the gym. I'm not eating in my bathroom because it's normal. though because usually like <laughs> when you talk to guys you're like like not look chest up it's like eyes here and then you know, there's some special people where you can't say eyes down you know? you don't even know. since we got leg day today I'm gonna put my knee sleeves on now because if I don't put them on now when I get to the gym then I'm gonna have to take my shoes off and it's a whole ordeal. So I'm putting them on now. So that we'll be good to go. I haven't been putting, these are my Gym Reapers one, by the way. Everything that I use for my gym gear is all Gym Reapers. Code Julia Renee if you wanna support ya girl. But literally everything that I have that's Gym Gear is all Gym Reapers and I use a lot of their leg day stuff because they got a ton of really good things and then these shoes are just these are dura body um there's just a company that i really love they have amazing lifting shoes and i have i want to say at least four of their shoes i literally just have them in every color one day let me know if you guys want this but we can do like a shoe tour because I went from having like one pair of lifting shoes and not really caring what my shoes looked like to being like completely obsessed and having a couple in each color. Why can't I get these on? I'm just like, because they're supposed to be toy. There we go. Darkness, my old friend. Okay. Gym time. Well, 
we work out. This is why you double knot. All right, that's my giant supplement cabinet. We got Intraformance. This is for, it's basically carbs. It's basically powdered carbs. We have EAAs, we have megawatt. We have one more thing, some salt. And I've been using my little gift that Ian got me to measure it out. I'm gonna be smart and I'm gonna take one of these out from the dishwasher because that's just smart. It's already clean. So There's no water. I think Zach killed it because I tried to fill up my cup and it was gone. Zachary? Now I have to use sink water. There's nothing wrong with sink water, but we don't really know what's in there, so maybe. Now, cut to super dope, super slow-mo. Too salty. If we put too much salt, it'll be a little too salty. But honestly, I'm really liking the salt in it. Tastes good. Mm. I lift it. Today is like a quad focused leg day, but the way that he structures it, like I can feel everything. And I feel it in my quads for sure, but like my glutes and hamstrings are still so activated. Like this is such a light weight and I can barely get it up. That's a shoot. workout's done. We literally like, we added weight on everything this week from last week. I mean, last week on squat, we only did a plate. Today we did three plates on each side, but we did a plate on each side. So we went up, we added two plates on each side for the, the uh, press. I, I work out, I swear. And we added 10 pounds on the walking lunges progress so I'm gonna roll these out because if I don't I know that when I get home like my legs will start getting stiff because I'm gonna go back home and start like finishing work for the day and I'll be sitting so rolling it out would be good but after that 
I'll catch you at home. <sighs> I'm already sore. Yeah. Guys, I gave everything in that workout. What's up, Vision? My body, my soul, my dignity. <laughs> you know, when you're like, have such a good workout or it's just like really hard, you're instantly, like when you sit down, you like wanna take a nap. Like the drive here, I was like, trying not to freaking fall asleep. So I'm gonna really focus on, do a little bit of recovery this evening have my post-workout meal and just feel better. I wonder what it's like to be you. It must be so fun. You're so cute. Okay guys, I am so <laughs> tired, oh my God. Uh, usually I would continue working. It's 7 p.m. and I, I'm, I just need to stop. I need to stop working this late. Um, Usually I stop at like 8 p.m., which I don't need to be doing. So I am going to probably go take an Epsom salt bath. I never take baths. I hate taking baths because it's like I get bored and I have to just sit there. So I'm going to make it interesting, but I know my body needs it. So I'm going to do a little bath. Um, Vision just hit his head on the desk. Oh, the baby. Do you want a geek of bath? He's so cute. Come here. There you go. Okay, you're in you're in the video. Are you happy? I love you. <laughs> Why inside my nose? You have to lick all of the boogers out of my nose. You are so weird. Okay, so I'm gonna take a little bath. I'll probably read a book or something just to chill. <sighs> it's been a long day, so I love you guys. And as always, you are more powerful than you think.